Government Center Station, one of the biggest subway stops on the MBTA, will begin a massive renovation on both the outside and inside of the station starting March 22nd for the duration of two years. The 24-month closure is part of a $90 million project to rebuild the station at City Hall Plaza. These scheduled improvements will comply with the American with Disabilities Act and an agreement made with the Boston Center for Independent Living, making the station safer and more accessible for everyone. The green and blue lines will also be made more efficient with the addition of new elevators and escalators, new interior finishings, a new security system, and much more. Over 11,000 people use this station on average during the week, and most will have to change up their daily commute due to this closure. Mark Alsina, a frequent subway rider, says that even though it will be a bit of an annoyance, it will be a better commute when the project is finished. I mean, I'm, I think it's probably a good thing. The station does not look very good, considering it's government center, like right next to the state buildings. Like, you would think it would be nicer. Uh, so hopefully they'll do a good job. Another writer, Sunny Abakwi, agrees with Mark and believes that the new station will be worth the wait. Well, it will be a temporary inconvenience for better good. So it will make the place more convenient and more efficient. The MBTA will be adding shuttle buses that will stop in front of Government Center every 20 minutes and travel to and from Haymarket Station. No fares will be collected on these shuttles. All other subway lines will continue to stop at their normal hours during their normal days of operation. The station is said to be reopened in spring of 2016. With Emerson College, I'm Danielle Herrera.